confusion about my sexuality. Uh, for a very, very short time before I entered showbiz, there was confusion. But, I don't know. Alex, I don't know how many of your girlfriends are going to be. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Girl, girlfriend pa ang kasama ni Alex, hindi pa boyle. <laughs> well, I think, I think, the, I think, uh, uh, Queen Eric, the reality of it is, I mean, I am fluid. I mean, in the Philippines, I think it's, it's, uh, bakla or straight, but I think that what this film aims to penetrate is the idea that hindi lang black or white ang sexuality, kundi sobrang daming kulay. Maybe one person is, you know, my, is more afraid of maybe a girl is more afraid of men so she's inclined to be with women kasi sa buhay niya natakot siya sa lalaki maybe may ganong part ng sexuality niya with me I, 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 I find myself to be fluid I flow in between right um, the only confusion to answer your question that I actually ran into mm-hmm. was uh, I had several conversations with Cornerstone my management about you know, maybe I should just come out because I'm not hiding. Hindi naman kasi ako nagtatago sa mga kaibigan ko outside of showbiz. Uh, sa totoo lang, sa fans lang naman talaga ako nagtatago because, alam mo yun, sa Philippines, may stigma pa. Uh, they always tell you, like, pag nag-out ka, tapos ng karir mo. Uh, pag nag-out ka, wala ka nang makuha project. Napapahit ka ka as Becky Roll. And uh, the real confusion really came when, you know, my management and my, my father were telling me, you know, not to... Uh, Siyempre, para protectan ako. Pero, you know, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. And I think in trying to protect me, maraming naging mas malala na issue yung pinagdaanan ko sa buhay ko. So, to wrap it up, I think the most clear moment I never had in my life in my sexuality was getting out of it. Because now, it's no longer about protecting this image na ginawa ko sa showbiz. It's about showing everybody exactly what I can do as an actor and the kinds of stories that I can tell without being hindered. Yeah, it definitely opened more new doors. I mean, I met Derek Edo, and then, you know, I'm doing this project with Dreamscape that I'm so thankful for, and yeah, yeah.